Hello, I'm excited to have you join me in today's vlog. Today is our day three of our 20 days of daily loads of benefits. And let me take this time to appreciate you immensely for subscribing, liking, and sharing my videos. The Lord honor you immensely. And on today's vlog, our topic is win a soul. Win your soul. Win your soul. Third John 2, the Bible says, I wish above all things that thou mayest prosper and be in health even as your soul prospereth in proportion to the prosperity of your soul. Exactly in accordance to your soul. That means that your prosperity or your progress or your acceleration in the remaining parts of this year, 2021, is dependent on the quality of your soul. Yes, you know, the soul is what um, the, the house for your mind, the house for your intellect, your emotions. The soul houses all of that. So it is wisdom, the Bible says in Proverbs chapter 11 and verse 30. He that winneth souls is wise. It is wisdom to win your soul. It is wisdom to take charge of your soul. Have you ever wondered why born again, tongue speaking, Holy Ghost filled believers write exams and they fail? That is because they have not fed their intellect. They have not fed the, their, their intellect. And so they just woke up and because they, they can speak in other tongues or they are believers, they say, Ah, oh, Father, I cover this exam with the blood of Jesus. And you don't cover mediocrity with the blood of Jesus. You feed your mind in that area. You feed your intellect. You study, you feed your intellect in that area so that you can make the most of it. So the prosperity or the progress of a man is in direct proportion to the progress of their soul. Your body or your mind or yourself, a man cannot be more progress, uh, cannot make more progress than his soul is making progress. So it is related. It, 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 that's what, you know, the Bible didn't say win your, win your spirit. The Bible didn't say win a body. The Bible didn't say win, win a spirit as important as a man's spirit is. The Bible says he that winneth souls is wise. Why? Because the soul is what feeds your body, is what feeds your, your spirit. Those thoughts that you allow to gain ascendancy into your soul, your spirit begins to speak them, to pick them. So you be careful. You don't allow garbage into, into your soul. The remaining parts of this year, when the negative thoughts want to come, you 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 trash them away. When 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 things want to come and distract you, you you take them off. You take off the distraction. You take charge of your soul. You don't sit down and allow yourself to be depressed. You don't sit down and allow your and allow negative thoughts thoughts come to your mind someone offended you and so what even jesus was offended yes jesus was betrayed you're not the first person to be betrayed so you dust yourself up and move whilst they are gossiping whilst they are talking and mocking you you are excited and then you are taking charge and your bible says whatsoever things are good whatsoever things are of good report if there be any virtue in it he said think on these things so when thoughts are coming into your mind, you be careful how you allow them because when they get hold of your, your not just your conscious mind, your subconscious, then they begin to feed your spirit. Before you know, you start reacting. The Bible says, as a man thinketh in his heart, so is he. Not so he will become. So is he. So you are your thoughts. Kaya Maya. You are your thoughts. So you cannot allow any kind of thoughts to come to your mind. When they come, you ask yourself, is it of good report? Is there any virtue in it? Is there, is, there, is there any peace in it? Is there any progress in these thoughts? If it is not in line with God's word, if it do not bring progress, if it do not bring peace, you trash it away. You trash it. Because when it gets to your heart, when it gets to your mind, your spirit will speak, you pick, will pick it. And before you know, your body is affected by it. So take charge of your mind. Win your soul, brother. Win your soul, sister. Win it. Take charge of it. That's how to make the most of the remaining parts of the year 2021 and even beyond. I'm super excited that you watched to the end. God bless you. Please always remember to subscribe and to share the link with someone who would like 
or who will be blessed by it. If today is your first time that you're joining, please let me know in the comment section. I'd like to connect with you. God bless you. Until tomorrow when I bring you another daily load of benefit, stay highly blessed and super favored of the Lord. I love you. God bless you.